who's to blame? How did we get here? What's going on? And the truth of the matter is, the only people that we have to look to is ourselves. We're to blame. We're the ones. Why are we closed? I had COVID-19. Made it. <laughs> Alive and kicking, baby. I lost about 20 pounds. I was looking like I was in my 20s again. Things were great. No, on a serious note, COVID-19 sucked for me. I got it really bad. It was not fun. But why are we closed? Why are we shutting down? Why are we living in our homes? Just now on CNN Today, an article was published about how loneliness is actually a good thing. Because it is real stuff right here. I'm not making this up. Fact check true. CNN, loneliness can help grow parts of the brain tied to imagination, study finds. Yeah, like people who talk to themselves on a random basis. They're never lonely ever. Do you see what's happening? Do you, do you feel what's going on? Do you see what they want to happen? They are training us or trying to train us to believe that it's okay to become dependent, that it's okay to not be exceptional in who you are. Exceptionalism, individualism, these are all parts of democracy. The founding fathers, life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. I've studied this the past several months, the pursuit of happiness. Why would we put that in there? Why? Why would we put those words, the pursuit of happiness? It's not the guarantee of happiness. It's not the government is going to take care of you happiness. It's the pursuit of happiness. Because the founding fathers imagined that we would not be lazy pieces of garbage that would want the government to take care of us for the rest of our lives. No, they wanted us to be actual Americans that would stand up, want to go to work, want to pay our bills, want to have something that we could be proud of other than the fact that AOC is running her mouth again.